John Brzezik versus Irakli Zirakashvili. Irakli is a more dangerous opponent for John than Oleg Petrenko, in my opinion. Much more dangerous opponent. Much more aggressive on the hand and wrist. Will target that more aggressively. Mm -hmm. As you know, I find it very difficult to bet against John. If John walked on water, I'd probably be all right with it. When I've seen John do stuff over the years that I've just thought, shut the... How, what, where, who... John has done stuff that, and he shut down guys when they were at their absolute. Guys like when Dima Kochev was killing people, just murdering people. And then John bullies him, you know, like makes a show. John is something else. And the one thing I will say about Irakli, as much as he poses an enormous threat in his best areas, he also has glaring areas of weakness. And it's whether John can get to the spots to put the brakes on him. And I always feel like John will find a way. He will try something. He'll sell his wrist and hand into the strap, sell his wrist and hand to a degree, and just bait off the, 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 the arm, apply back and side, put the brakes on. If he gets the brakes on, John will adapt better and he will come back and win the match. My money's on John. I see Irakli as a massive threat. Massive threat. I tell you something. If I would choose a guy who is dangerous for John, uh, Irakli would be one of them. Currently, Irakli is one, and Ongo Bias the other. Yes, yes. In he, in this this category, um, in my opinion, because of uh, the age, the, the 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 signals, speed to go to the hand. You understand? Mm. He is strong, but he is not like explosiveness. You know, hand is not that quick and fast anymore. So th these guys are hidden exactly there, and their specialty mm -hmm. is. Uh, this so that is why this guy is one of the yeah. most dangerous guys for John. When we he, spoke before John pulled Kurdigali, and we were on the yeah. phone, and you said, "What do you think, Neil?" And I said, "Whoa, Kurdigali's dangerous." Now I know John was ill, and I actually want to see that rematch. Yeah, why not? I really want to see it, <coughs> but I wasn't surprised when Kurdigali gave him major problems mm -hmm. because stylistically. He's problematic match for John. Mm -hmm. When we spoke about Petrenko, I didn't see that threat. I do see the threat from Zirakashvili. I do see Irakli being a dangerous match. Stylistically, that, that venomous, explosive top roll is hard to get hang of. Something. Neither John or Irakli can control each other's tornado only with wrist, wrist power. That, that is... Too much for John and too much for Irakli, the hands. So it is going to be more like the outside versus outside. But during that outside, if somehow, if the position is equal like this, flat wrist. John wins that match. John John wins that one with the, with the yeah. more experience. Remember, remember Liliev. Liliev and John in Turkey. Yeah, yeah. Once he stop here and then he turns. Then when he the stops, he can sell his own wrist. He can drop his own wrist, and he can pull from anywhere. The yeah, guy's yeah, yeah. ability in, yeah. in, in a so what I'm just saying that bad Iraqi, position is second. Iraqi, you know, should not focus on the top roll and John. He needs to focus on having some yeah, control. He, he needs to have integrity yeah, in that hand and wrist. Iraqi, yes, but if John flattens his wrist like this. He's fucked. That, that, that match is over because yes, his side pressure is and his muscle memory, his experience about that kind of pulling is better. No matter what, what his uh, right now current form is, he needs to have some of here, some. If, if, if he topples John's totally, John is like this, he wins. If John topples him, he wins. If the match is equally like this, John still wins. But as you realize, when Ongarbev and John Poole, it was not like you know flat flat, but mm -hmm. you know Ongarbev had the some some wrist. 
So if Iraq can put John into that position, it will be hard. And I, and I think John will do at some stage. I think John gets the breaks on, and I think that's how he wins the match. Uh, John sixty forty. <coughs> so you are saying John is going to win? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Um, the the bad part about this East versus West predictions, I, I can't really say everything I want to say. I know. Yeah, you know. Yeah, because I'm organizer. Anything I say will be taken uh, wrongly. <laughs> 